111 and the nays are 112. The bill is passed. On this vote, the ayes are 311 and the nays are 112. The bill is passed. Oh, one voting present. I missed it, but thank you. Okay. The House will be in order. The House will be in order. The chair would remind my colleagues to observe proper decorum. Flag waving on the floor is not, is not appropriate. The House will be in order. Without objection, a motion to reconsider is laid on the table. For what purpose does the gentleman from Florida rise? I said, no. The gentlewoman from Florida. The gentlewoman is not recognized. Colleagues, no, I'm going to. The House will be in order. There you have it, guys. The United Mistake of Ukraine. The House Representative waving Ukrainian flag in the House of Rep in Congress of the United States. The brainwashed the liberal Democrats are now have sold the United States and now with they're waving Ukrainian flag. So if you are an American citizen, if you are trying to become an American citizen, if you try to, to come to United States, we no longer have United States of America. It's United Mistakes of Ukraine. So uh, the proof is in the pudding. What can I say? What can I say? That flag behind me doesn't exist anymore. Now, if you're a Democrat, you just burned the U.S. flag and you celebrated the Ukrainian flag by having the morons you voted for in uh, in office for uh, you know representing you. So, if you voted for that individual who was waving Ukrainian flag, you're the moron who voted for another moron. You know, there, there's no one being nice about you know how stupid Democrats are getting and how stupid they are and how treasonous they are. These are the treasonous act of uh, the Democratic Party. So let's see, read the buzz. This is from Fox News. So if this triggers you, please go away. Um, House Democrats have come under fire for waving the Ukrainian flag in the chamber of the United States House of Representatives during a vote to approve a $60 billion in aid for the country's defense. $60 billion. $60 billion. Uh, Ukrainian flags fly in the chambers of the United States House of Repre Representatives as they vote to send more of your hard-earned money to a corrupt foreign regime. I've said it's corrupt. I always stand by the fact that I know Ukraine is corrupt. Ukraine is the, mon is the hub for money laundering and sex trafficking. Now, if you don't believe me, go look it up. Uh, Senator Rand Paul said in a post on X Saturday. And just like that, they shout Ukraine, 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 while happily working to secure Ukraine's border and not ours. Paul's post comes after the House approved a spending package that will send $60 billion to Ukraine to aid in its defense against Russian invasion, part of an overall $95 billion foreign aid plan that also includes additional aid for Israel. While the package itself, which passed in a 311 to 112 vote, faced fierce opposition among some lawmakers, others took part particular offense to a moment at the end of the vote when Democrats began passing around Ukrainian flags to wave as the time on the vote expired. The move was a violation of House protocol, according to Rep uh, Representative Mark um, Molirano, who presided over the vote and told those waving the flag that the display was inappropriate. Molano, you know what? You wave another country's flag, that vote should be voided. How about that? That vote should be completely voided. Not inappropriate, voided. And those who hold the Ukrainian flag as a representative of their district should be arrested for treason. 
because now they are taking U.S. tax dollars, sending it to a country that they want to represent. They're not representing you anymore. They're representing Ukraine. They are the Ukrainian uh, lobbyists. They are the Ukrainian monkeys who are voting to send your money, the tax dollar money, to the defense of a shithole country. Am I upset? Hell yeah, I am. Fuck these people. Um, yeah. Moreno's comments elicited jeers from Democrats in the chamber, but was backed up by Representative Anna Paulina Luna, who took the microphone and told her fellow lawmakers to put those damn flags away. Luna would take as to social media later to echo a similar sentiment, arguing that it was a disgrace to display any other flag than the American flag in the House of uh, in the House chambers. She's right. She's absolutely right. The flag waving was blasted by more GOP lawmakers on social media. You know what? These GOP lawmakers can go shove their heads up their own asses. Sorry, this uh, this content is going to have a lot of profanity in it because those assholes voted for this stupid bill too. So if you are a Republican that voted for this fucking bill, you are no better than the Democrats. Flags on the uh, Democrats chanted Ukraine while waving Ukrainian flags on the floor of the United States House of Representatives. Big said on X, the unit party approved 60, 60.8 billion more for Ukraine while the U.S. quickly approaches approach 35 trillion dollars in debt. The so the bigger of the entire world, Zelensky has a great game because he has the Democrats wrapped around his fingers. These dumb ass Democrats. If you're a Democrat, you're a dumbass. Just plain point blank. Um, you voted for these assholes. You deserve them, and I, I and I wish you nothing good coming out of these people because this what what happens to you directly is the result of how you vote. It's the result of you putting these dumbasses in here and you have no right to bitch and complain. And that goes to people in New York, Chicago, LA, anybody that voted Democrat. You have no room to complain about anything. If you're black, if you're Hispanic, I don't give a shit. You don't have room to complain about a single thing that's happening to your life. Zero. Absolutely zero place. You can't come out here uh, and say racism. You can't come out here xenophobe, mo uh, any phobe, any phobe of any kind, any ism of any kind. Zero room because of this. This is this is your doing. This is not anybody else's doing because you're you're a sheep and you follow this crap and you're not a policy voter. You're just a party voter. If you're just a party voter, this is what you deserve. And I hope. And I hope this continues and makes your life a living hell because this is what you've done to yourself and everybody else around you. There's no room for you to bitch and complain. Rents are high. There's no room for you to bitch and complain about white privilege or any other privilege or anybody making more money than you. Or anybody is raising the rent on you and you can't afford the groceries because this is your doing. Not anybody else's. You voted for this garbage. You should eat it too. This, is, this should be on your dinner plate every night. Um, anyways, House Democrats are waving Ukraine flags on the House floor as members of Congress vote to send nearly $61 billion to Ukraine. Uh, added on X, disgusting, too much Ukraine, not enough USA. Senator Mike Lee, uh, cooked on X and shared, blah, 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 blah. You know what? I don't give a shit. I don't give a damn. Uh... The United States is gone. There's nothing to protect here anymore, guys. This is, you know, w w there's nothing to fight for anymore. Because of, you know, what we see in Congress, what we see out of Republicans and Democrats. And, you know, um, I don't see anything they are doing as a viable source of anything. Right? Nothing's viable at this point. If you are trying to make a living, have a good retirement, scratch that. That's not going to happen anymore, okay? Unless you started 15, 10, 15 years ago and started maxing out your 401k, lived like a, uh, lived like you're in Section 8, 
Maybe. But there's no more future. There's no more future for this country. This country is gone. It doesn't matter if Trump comes into the office or not. This country is gone. Absolutely gone. It's gone to shit. So, I don't know. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Uh, I, I, sorry for the rant, but, you know, it's necessary. Uh, I, I, I need to get it out of my chest because why not? Peace out.